The other night I went to an arcade and I got enough tickets to get this trick mustard bottle. Oh my god! <laughs> it's just string. It's such a good trick. And then it takes five minutes to reload the string. What's up everybody? So in the past I've had some pretty good luck with galaxy themed stuff. Okay, literally just the eggs. They went phenomenal. I actually got a tweet. Actually, let me give a shout out to who tweeted me this. Cassidy, at it's Cassidy time. She tweeted me and said I should make these things. It looked like a pretty inexpensive craft. Today we're making galaxy jars. Here's what you need for them. First, you're gonna need to buy a mason jar or any kind of glass cylindrical thing that holds items. <laughs> Next, you're gonna need some galaxy colored paints. So I've gone with pink, I have light blue, gold, dark purple, and dark blue. You're gonna need some glitter, those are gonna be like the stars in the nebula. You're gonna need a bunch of cotton balls. So the place that I bought my cotton balls at literally had one size, and it was the I'm making my own pillow size. Look at this! More than enough, you need some water. You can almost fit all the contents inside the jar itself. There, there you go! You can give this as a gift for somebody. Boom! They got everything they need. Now, I've never done these. Saw one picture and then I researched the rest on Tumblr. I have no idea how these are gonna turn out. Let's give it a shot. Here's how you make some galaxy jars. Okay, we're gonna start off with our water, our acrylic paint. Drop it in. Just a couple clumps, so it looks like Pepto-Bismol. <laughs> That's enough. Next, you're gonna mix in the, the paint. Literally, so it looks like Pepto-Bismol. This is crazy. That actually almost looks tasty, but I learned my lesson uh, last year not to drink paint. Put that over there. Get our next glass. Put some blue in there. Probably enough. Cotton candy mixture right here. For this one, we're gonna do dark purple. Get a spoon, mix her up. So we have our three colors, so let's go on to the next step. You wanna take the jar, bunch of cotton balls, start picking the cotton balls apart, fluffing them out a bit, and dropping them in the jar. My hand's not gonna fit in there. Grab anything that could poke it, <laughs> I'm using a TV remote. This is a layered process. Once you have your first layer of cotton balls in, take your first color and we'll do, uh, we'll do pink. Pour the pink in. Literally the worst pour of my life. Of course it had to be captured on camera because I can't do anything perfect on camera. If it's too watery, you just wanna put in some more cotton balls. So next you're gonna open up your glitter. If ever you spill glitter, it's literally everywhere for all of eternity. Mix that around. We're gonna do purple. You don't wanna quite squish them down. We're gonna pour the purple in now. Not too much this time though. That, like, 90% of that didn't get in. It's gonna start to mix a little bit. Screw ripping them apart. Toss in some glitz. All right, we're gonna mix in the glitter. Boom, boom, toss it to the sides. I'm even gonna rip these apart. I'm gonna shove them in. Okay, so it didn't really do anything. <laughs> okay, so we have our first jar, which I will, let's call it a learning experience. <laughs> this didn't work out at all. This looks like Katy Perry threw up in a jar. Let's try the second one, more spacey, I hope. This honestly looks like unicorn crap. That was a test one. Let's put that aside. Oh my God. Okay, um, let's try this again. Purple, dark blue, and gold. I don't wanna use as much paint. I think that's where I went wrong. Put the glitter in next. It's already looking way better. I probably should have bought like a black or like a really dark color because this is gonna be a pretty bright uh, space effect. Ah, oh my goodness, okay, so it's a little messy. Okay, so there you guys have it. These are my galaxy jars. I must say they didn't turn out as good as the galaxy eggs. This one turned out way better. 
The difference is the first time that I did it, I put way too much paint. It wasn't as transparent as it should be. I would suggest if you guys are doing this, try using food coloring because it keeps the water clear, whereas this kind of fogs it up. This one was better because I made it a lot more diluted where you can actually see the effect that the cotton balls have. If you don't want to buy the jars, you can make these out of old water bottles. There you guys have it. Follow me on Instagram at Danocracy. You can follow me on Twitter at the Danocracy. Tweet me or uh, tag me in your pictures of your own galaxy jars. I'd love to see you guys do way better ones than I did. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and I'll see you guys in my next video. See you guys later.